Well, it can happen in the blink of an eye year round, but these days, porch pirates are finding more opportunities to snatch that freshly delivered box from your porch. And as Jade Cunningham explains, there are things you can do to make sure it doesn't happen to you. It doesn't matter who you are or where you live. Anyone can be a victim of a package theft, especially now with the pandemic and the holidays. A lot of people are shopping online these days and as boxes start stacking up, the wandering eyes of package thieves are sure to make their way to your front door. But there are easy things you can do to make sure that doesn't happen. One way is to ship the item to a P.O. box, a friend's house or a place of work. Work, though, for a lot of people right now is their house. So when choosing a delivery option, don't be afraid to write specific instructions on where to leave the package. Also be sure to get that tracking number so you know where it is and when it's delivered. And for important items, require a signature for drop off. You can also have it shipped to a local mail service or locker for pickup. UPS does that. Amazon will also send packages to their hub lockers located all over the city. Prefer FedEx? They'll ship to the closest Walgreens where it'll be kept secure until you're able to pick it up. In terms of technology, some people have invested in surveillance cameras, even video doorbells. And while that doesn't always deter porch pirates, New Orleans police say that surveillance does come in handy if a package is taken. These measures are easy and take seconds to implement, which means the next time that porch pirate is on the hunt, you'll be enjoying that package instead of looking for it. Jay Cunningham, Eyewitness News. New Orleans police also suggest to not have multiple packages delivered at the same time. That way you won't draw attention to possible package thieves.